Depression is a complex and life-changing condition. Most treatments are drug-related and may only manage the condition, but rarely ends it. Many patients ask if there is anything natural they can do to solve depression or to ease the symptoms. The answer is yes, and it's worth the try. Stay tuned and I'll explain. I'm Dr. David Dahlman for drdahlman.com. Depression, also known as major depressive disorder, clinical depression, major depression, unipolar depression, or unipolar disorder, is a mental disorder characterized by a lack of the sense of well-being, accompanied by low self-esteem and loss of interest or pleasure in normally enjoyable everyday activities. Major depression is a disabling condition which negatively influences a person's family, work or school life, sleeping and eating habits, and general health. Most patients are treated with antidepressant medication and some with counseling. These medications many times come with another set of side effects requiring additional medication to, sol to solve the side effects of the antidepressant. Let's talk about some of the causes of depression. First, I must say that there are certainly reasons for depress depression that no discussion like this could ever solve. Perhaps it's a uniqueness in an individual that predisposes them to it. Others may have had circumstances in life that create this situation for them. We won't necessarily solve that for them in this video. But what about milder depression or cases of depression that might have another cause? If you consider that a sense of well-being is governed by brain chemistry and that our diet is the source of the nutrients that our body draws from to make that brain chemistry, could some cases of mild to moderate depression be affected by a change in diet? How about some dietary supplements to add to those necessary nutrients that you get from your diet? A multivitamin at the very least. Fresh whole foods is the, is the place to start. Stay away from fast foods and processed foods. Eat good oils and fats, no hydrogenation. Sugar, though tasty, needs to be restricted. Eat organic if possible and stay away from chemicals, preservatives, additives, and colorings in your food. And no artificial sweeteners. Interestingly, interestingly an herb called St. John's wort has been shown to have a positive effect on the production of serotonin, which is the main neurotransmitter that allows our sense of well-being. The bottom line is to eat a clean diet, take a regimen of dietary supplements, and try St. John's wort. For a list of my recommendations for dietary supplements, please visit drdahlman.com and see my wellness program recommendations by clicking on vitamins, which you'll find on the left side of drdahlman.com, and then reading the article that I've written called Vitamins for You. And feel free to call me with any questions about a supplement protocol or to help you design a complete plan to regain your health. This is Dr. David Dahlman for drdahlman.com. To read more information and view additional videos about natural therapies for many chronic health conditions, please visit drdahlman.com.